final pieces to this campsite. Uh, bag of food, got a cooler behind me. All the fajitas for this evening. Uh, this thing right here is the fire disc. This is the actual disc. Yeah, it's getting salt water on it. Yeah, I'm gonna clean it up when I get to the island and then clean it up when I get it back. Uh, yeah, this is the uh, GKF Little Tybee camping paddle. So uh, we got a big group out here. We're gonna be doing some group cooking, some fishing, some camping, exploring this uh, whole island chain right here for the weekend. It's a cool little trip down here off of Tybee Island, which is close to Savannah in Georgia. But uh, yeah, it's good stuff. Also, I'm in the Shearwater 125 with a Bixby. Absolutely shredding this wind. Um, current conditions right now is the tide is coming out or coming up and in. So it's coming through that mouth right there and through uh, the part of the creek right here. And uh, I'm really racing against the clock to get back before the sandbars get breached. But I'm doing pretty good. Like I said, I've got a Bixby. I've already made one trip today. This is the second trip. Full power, and I've got... I don't even think there's a there's a light out. I think there's five or six lights there on the Bixby battery. I don't think there's even a light out on the Bixby, so... It's running tough. So far, so good. And I'm looking at... I don't know. It's not too crazy of a wind. Probably... 8 to 10 mile an hour consistent in my face uh, but with the Shearwater's you know knife like bow and the Bixby power you know I'm just setting a heading and hitting that hole and trying to cover as much ground as I possibly can without you know spending any energy and that's uh that's the name of the game folks Sometimes it's not all about first one to a spot. But it's shaping up to be a beautiful weekend. We had storms in uh, Atlanta all last night. And a week out from this trip, we were supposed to get rain all weekend this weekend. And then a few days before, the weather forecast completely changed. No rain for Tybee, which is awesome. And uh, it looks like that storm that was projected to kind of come through Tybee just didn't make it that far east so all right so the first trip over it took me about 15 15 17 minutes or so to get from ramp to camp um so i'm expecting about the same on this one um based on the way the tides are on sunday i think they'll be coming back in when we're leaving so uh, that's a situation where you can just ride it out. You know, I mean, on my way back with the wind at my back and the Bixby at like half speed, you know, it probably took me 10 minutes. On the way there, about 17, but that's just because I'm fighting the water and the, and the headwind. All right, get back at you when we get on the island. <laughs> 